Want to see a shelf cloud? Yes. There's a shelf cloud. How about hey. that? Coming right into downtown Birmingham. And understand shelf clouds have nothing to do with a tornado, nothing to do with a wall cloud. That's the leading edge of a band of strong storms. In fact, the storms are under severe limits, but a lot of those CLCs in the Alabama sky today, creepy looking clouds. A level one out of five, marginal risk of severe storms west of I-65. Most of these storms will stay below severe limits this evening, but they are a nuisance if you're trying to do something outdoors. You can see the heavier storms coming into Birmingham. They've shown a weakening trend over the past 15 to 30 minutes, but again, there's still peaks, uh, could be some spots with gusty winds, maybe some small hail, heavy rain for a brief time, and certainly cloud to ground lightning, but not as many lightning strikes. Nine strikes here in the past 10 minutes in this zone with that activity coming into Birmingham. We've got heavier storms down to the southwest coming through parts of Sumter County, especially along and north of Interstate 59. Most likely hail is falling here in that cell near Cuba. That's near the Alabama Mississippi state line. These will track across parts of Hale and Greene counties later tonight, possibly producing again some small hail and strong gusty winds. All of this will gradually fade late tonight after midnight. And for the weekend, we're beginning to see signs the ridge will be strengthening. That means heat levels going up, rain coverage going down tomorrow and on Sunday. Where the rain is falling, we have upper 60s now, 68 for Jasper, Coleman, and Haleyville. Ahead of that line of storms, 83 in Centerville, 86 in Utah, 81 for the Shelby County Airport, Birmingham 79, Anniston currently at 78. Overnight tonight, rain and storms this evening diminishing after midnight, lows tomorrow morning, mid to upper 60s. We're expecting highs fairly close to 90 tomorrow. As heat levels rise, we think this will be the hottest weekend so far this year. Tomorrow morning, we should be dry to start the day. That's 615. We're expecting mid to upper 60s. Now, tomorrow, could there be a shower or storm? Yes, no doubt about that, but they should be widely scattered, meaning many locations will not see rain tomorrow. A mixed of clouds and sunshine. Check out the numbers. That's 3.30 tomorrow afternoon. Highs upper 80s to near 90. Birmingham possibly at 91 degrees and we'll see similar heat levels on Sunday. So tomorrow and Sunday, partly sunny, widely scattered afternoon and evening storms. Many places dry. Highs around 90. Next week, highs in the 80s for the first half of the week with a chance of scattered showers and storms. Evidence we could trend drier by Thursday and Friday with fewer showers and slightly lower humidity values. We could see low 60s by Thursday morning of next week. You can catch my forecast every day on great radio stations around the state, including in Birmingham, 98.7 KISS. And you can stay ahead of the weather with the ABC 3340 weather app. You'll have access to live radar, James weather blog and the 10 day forecast.